Coach Abel here along with Coach Weiss and the Able Body Experts adding to the video library. Again, the focus of innovation training. Yes, load is, is important, but load isn't about how much weight is on the bar. Coach, load is about how much stress the muscle is under, and I think a lot of people don't understand that. Yeah, the difference between, between working the muscles and lifting weights is, is the numbers on the bar, and that's the thing. As you'll see here, we're using a band. We have no idea what the actual number of resistance is, and it really doesn't matter when it but comes you, to working the muscles. But you'll sure feel it. Yeah. And the other aspect of innervation training in my book, The Able Approach, is that ranges and planes of motion are also important for muscle activation, and then the load variant matters. So we're going to do two variations of a tricep pushdown. If you have tricep pushdowns in your program, you've got to give these a whirl. I love them, and it really takes a lot of strain off the shoulders. I'm discovering a lot of these movements because my shoulders are so shot after four decades of, of overachieving. So uh, Coach is going to show us some tricep pushdown variations. Again, we're using the incline bench. We're just hooking the tubing. Again, create your own dungeon at home if you like. He brings it in, he starts at shoulder level, and he comes down and he's going to push through the floor. He's going to get that peak contraction in the tries. Now, if you're doing this straight up and down standing, in a vertical, you got a lot of stress on the shoulders and even the wrists. This is a beautiful, just purely tricep oriented tension in the muscle. You get that peak contraction at the bottom. I get him to try to push toward my hand or the floor. Either way, he gets to fully extend those triceps and it pulls him back. So you've got that continuous tension and peak contraction payoff. Great, that's one variation. Now we're gonna move right into another. He's just gonna do this version. He's gonna lean into the incline now. Changes again the mechanical aspects of the pole. And you can spread your legs right out to get a little bit of balance. And he comes down, look at the back of those triceps, folks. Look at the back of those triceps on the inside. Can you catch that, Brad? Look at that working. You can't catch that on a normal tricep pushdown. So there you go. And that's two versions of a cable tricep pushdown using tubing and an incline bench. We change the trajectory, and anytime you make minor changes uh, in any kind of movement, you affect how the muscle works. Go tell that feel. It's a really good movement, and, and uh, like I, you were saying, when you're set on the bench like that, all the stress is on the triceps. You're not getting people that are, you see in the gyms, guys using way throwing too much weight, weight throwing the weight down. Can't do it here. No, if you try to throw the weight from back here, you're just going to end up falling back on the bench. So. And the beauty of the band, of the band is in the strongest position, in the peak contracted position is where the most resistance is. Yeah, so it's a fantastic movement for really working the arms. Again, innervation training is all about thinking differently. It's about train for development and strength will come and not the other way around.